Hi, I'm Alan Rouleau. You're in my showroom at 125 Newberry Street, home of Rogue Barbers and Alan Rouleau Couture. We're a custom tailoring shop. We've been on Newberry Street 28 years, in business in Boston for 32. I'm born and bred in Massachusetts. I've lived here my whole life. To actually open up an old school barber shop. I've always wanted to be able to have a place where you can do straight razor shaves, and master barbers, uh, kind of a dying art that's becoming uh, a strong revival actually in the men's industry. So combining the grooming side and the dressing side seemed a natural fit for us to come in. And then being able to hire uh, master barbers like John Molino and Travis Bone, we're able to offer not only classic haircuts coming in for both father and young sons, we're also doing straight razor shaves, three different levels, and we're also just added a whole new line of facials for men. Uh, something new that men probably are not used to doing, uh, not going into a, a salon per se to do it, but encouraging men to take better care of themselves, just as well as we do with the men's clothing side. This is my dressing room, so I keep most of my sports mem memorabilia in here. So we'll have our Red Sox players, our Patriots players, um, that was Tim Wakefield. Uh, I was working with Nomar Garcia Parra back in the day. We have the Celtics over here winning a championship. I have a great uh, artist in South Boston. Uh, did Coach Belichick's uh, picture right there. Um, the coach has been a great client of mine for a number of years. I help him uh, dress when he's off the field, from, um, specifically when he's doing his charity events like the Bill Belichick Foundation and the Think Pink and the events he goes to, such as the Kentucky Derby or a golf class. I realized that giving back was going to be a big part of my repertoire. It's actually that we've never turned out a charity ever. So from golf events to, we target a lot with children. And in the recent years, we've actually done more with people with disabilities and handicaps who might have had not the ability to access the correct dress for whatever the handicap they have. So I started working with the Courageous Faces Foundation about three years ago. I met a gentleman named Reggie Bibbs from uh, Houston uh, who has neurofibromatosis. It's, a, it's a, uh, a condition where your tumors grow in the nervous system. It's uh, similar to elephant man's disease and it, it's uncomfortable and it can be fatal. And it, leads, it leads to um, your body not staying in shape the way it should be. So we were able to create a wardrobe for this gentleman in Houston.